So hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we will cover another amazing cloud run lab that is cloud run functions 4. So first of all click on start lab and then open console incognito window. Now basically here it is getting signed in automatically sometimes it may ask for username and password so you can enter it. Now click on I understand. So basically in previous video we missed the task one that is creating the function. So first of all copy the Kanban application, open a new tab. And now here we have to create a function. So this video will be little bit detailed so that all of you are able to complete this lab without any issue. Now from here you have to just type function. Just type function and click on create crowd run function. So once you have created this, here you have to click on write a function. So when you click on write a function, a new page will open. And we have to create function number one. So for function number one, check the name as CF Node.js. Check the name from the Kanban application. And from here, you have to check the region. And it's already Node.js, so we don't have to update the runtime environment. And we have to allow unauthenticated invocations and set the instance number. So here, you have to click on containers, volumes, and security. Here, just update the maximum number of instances to five and then go to security and update the service account to arcade hero service account so now these tasks have been done now here we will click on create and wait for the function to be created so it will take some time so wait for it meanwhile if you are new to this channel like the video and subscribe the channel so finally the function is active now we'll hit check my progress for this task wait for some time So make sure there is no any mistake. So now when you will hit check my progress, you will get the score without any issue. Now for part two, we have to create again another function. Click on back button. Now click on leave. Now go back to the Kanban application and here click on it. So basically here we have to create a pop sub function. So copy the name. Enter the name, the region will be same as per lab instruction. Then click on add trigger and from here select pop sub trigger. So now here you have to check. We have to select the topic named as project arcade hero. That is project ID and arcade hero. So this is this. Now we don't have to make any other modifications. So now here we have to again allow unauthenticated invocations and now update the instance to maximum 5 number. Now we don't have to change the, I mean we don't have to change the service account. So if you want you can update but there is no need but still update it for betterment. Now wait for this function to get created. So it will hardly take 10 to 15 seconds. Then we will move forward to the lab instruction and check my progress. Apart from this, if you haven't liked the video, like it and subscribe the channel. So finally we got full score without any issue and we are done with the lab guys. 